Let's be certain to stock up on some extra ammunition before we explore the wilderness around us. You expecting me to jump down after you? You can be assured that our vault is the most secure place in the... Never ever go outside the city walls. I get all? I want to do your business quick. Take a gander. Harness that type of power.
You should talk with Duncan. I handle the boring behind the trade authority scenes, looks to got it. I have things for you. I can't think of a better place to recharge and ready ourselves for our next mission.
I have things for you. Well, well. Back fishing for a handout, eh? <laughs> See you soon, love. Walter spends a fortune to maintain the lodge, but I'd say it's worth every credit.
make it work. I'll leave it to you. Nice handiwork. I like your style.
Mayday! Mayday! This is Free Star Ranger Nia Kalu. If anyone is hearing this, system's failing. Need help. I repeat, need help. Welcome to Free Star Space. We're gonna do a quick scan for contraband. See you on your way. We're good to go. All clear to land at Hometown. It's you. Please tell me you're here to help. Not to try and steal my ship. <laughs> you need my help. Uh, I'd laugh if it didn't hurt so much. I was tracking a crew of outlaws that's been preying on merchant ships. Bastards got the drop on me. I ran them off, but they got a few good hits in. As you can see, I ain't in much shape to make repairs. I'll be fine once the pain medication kicks in. The priority right now is the ship. Can't do my job without it. Just patch her up enough to get to Hopetown. The rest can get fixed up there. Thanks. I owe you one. We're happy to help.
Thanks. That should get me home. You're right. They were pretty beat up, so I don't think they got real far. But if they make it back to their hideout, I might never find them again. We can't let that happen. They look to be heading for Polvo's Moon Miatha. Good hunting. I don't want to hear any complaints. This can't happen. You here? You ready to do some business? Music to my... Ready to do some business? What are you looking for? once. I do this. You made it. Those outlaws didn't give you too much trouble, I trust? Good. I'm sure it didn't hurt that I softened them up for you. 
You've got good timing. A courier just came in from Aquila. The Marshal sends his regards along with a briefing on your case. I was surprised as hell to learn about the starship theft. Nobody said a word to me about it. Anyway, Mr. Hope can see us whenever you're ready. If you need to take a little time first, feel free. His office is upstairs. He's in a meeting, but it should be wrapping up. Come on. Ron Hope certainly embodies the saying, spared no expense. Ron Hope isn't just the founder and president of Hope Tech. He's on the Council of Governors. The Council oversees the Free Star Rangers, so don't rile him. I've spent a long time trying to build a good relationship with Hope. <laughs> he comes on a little strong, but there's a lot to admire about the man. Everything you see around you, he built. Pretty much everyone in this town owes him for their livelihood. Can't begin to imagine the kind of pressure that must put on someone. All I'm saying is, try to show a little respect. All the way up. Is it just me, or does every executive in the settled systems have an office on the top floor? Uh, I guess being above everyone makes them feel like they're, well, <laughs> above everyone. except for the factory as for parts we could try outsourcing do a contract with scavengers maybe but that's a decision that's got to be made upstairs hmm. well, talk to elaine about the scavengers it's not a bad idea provided we get a good deal and i don't mean a fair deal i mean a good deal remember it's not just our bottom line that matters we're also responsible for the welfare of everyone in the factory. We look out for our people here, Birchett. That's a point of great personal pride. Um, excuse me, uh, Mr. Hope? Well now, the Free Star Rangers. At last! <laughs> ah, damn, good to see you. I think we're done here, Birchett. Yes, sir. This is the deputy I told you about. Splendid. Splendid! It's a noble calling, being a Free Star Ranger. Mm, we certainly could use more of you. Let's get down to it, shall we? Time is money. I'm sure I don't have to tell you what an outrage it is to have a ship stolen right out of the factory. Justice must be done, and the sooner the better. That's good news. I'll send my people over to bring it home. Of course, that doesn't mean your work is done. I want the thief found, and prosecuted to the full extent of the law. I'm sure I don't need to remind you of my position on the Council of Governors. I'm glad we understand each other. I'm not certain why you choose to back this Free Star elitist snob, but that's your choice. I'll back your play, but I don't have to like it. Now, tell me that you've at least got a lead of some kind, hmm? Though what happened after the ship was taken doesn't concern me, what does concern me is making sure that this doesn't happen again. Well, I'm not sure I can be much help, but I'll answer whatever questions I can. Because I told them not to. If word got out, it would do irreparable harm to our image. I'm in 
fierce competition with other starship manufacturers, any sign of weakness could be fatal. Uh, what's more, every starship thief in the settled systems would, would likely flock to Hopetown and start planning the next heist. Very well. I need you to understand something, Deputy. This town is home to men, women, and children who depend on Hope Tech for a living. I provide jobs that put food on their tables and a roof over their heads. It's a responsibility that I take very seriously. If word gets out about the stolen ship, my investors will lose trust and my workers will pay the price. I can't allow that. Well, heavy is the head that wears the crown. <laughs> I'm sure the burden of responsibility for your workers is an inconvenience, Mr. Hope. But the deputy has responsibilities as well. Despite what you think, I have great respect for the badge and the difficult choices that come with it. But my primary concern is for the welfare of my people. A ranger's first duty is to protect the people of the Free Star Collective. If your carelessness costs my workers their livelihoods, then you've utterly failed in that duty. I hope you understand that, Deputy. I'm sorry to interrupt, Mr. Hope, but there's been a development. Not now, Cosette. I'm in the middle of something. But, sir, we have new information. I've just received a report that the stolen ship was seen landing at Neon just after the theft. A breakthrough at last. Well, Deputy, it sounds like you'll be heading to Neon, which means I can get back to work. Remember what we discussed. My people are depending on you. Hey, can I get a word? That wasn't as helpful as it could have been. Still, at least you know where to pick up the trail. Let's hope. So, guess you're headed for Neon. There's a ranger station there. Name's Jalen Price. He's a little different than the rest of us. But a Neon's a different kind of place. Good. That should help you avoid any unnecessary complications. Well, we've both got work to do. It was good to meet you, Deputy. Thanks again for helping me out up there. No problem. Good luck on Neon, Deputy. We're going to be visiting the Astral Lab while we're here. I mean, that's a given, right? Interesting. This district's a... Hey, I don't care who you work for. You can't just... Oh, you're the rookie, aren't you? The one and only. Well, the Marshal's message said you were following a lead about a stolen ship. Truth is, a lot of stolen goods flow through here, but this city is real good at keeping its secrets, even from us. Yeah, about that. This isn't Aquila City. The badge doesn't carry the same weight here. The 
The people who run this place aren't overly concerned about the law. Our job is to keep the peace and make sure the violence doesn't get out of hand. The last thing anyone around here wants is some hotshot deputy looking in every dark corner. Law enforcement isn't exactly welcome in Neon, but that shouldn't deter you from your duty. Good. I can't believe this. You're shirking your responsibility based on what this fool thinks. <sighs> you have a lot to learn about duty and honor. Your stolen ship would have had to land at the spaceport. If it was right off the factory floor, it would have stood out. There's a guy I know, Billy Clayton, does maintenance work around the city and keeps an eye on ship traffic for me. I'll introduce you, but don't expect a favor. Even if it doesn't cause credits, nothing in Neon is free. Come on. Pretty impressive how you volunteered to help out with the bank heist in Aquila City. Yeah, I read all the reports. I learned quickly that a Neon staying informed and staying alive are closely linked. What stood out to me was that you didn't lose a single hostage. No wonder the Marshal tried to recruit you right away. If he hadn't, it would have made him look like a fool having some random stranger step in and do the job he couldn't. Now, if someone tried to hold up a bank here, they 